So here we have an eastern spotted newt in this woodland pool, mixing with all sorts of wood frog salamander, of wood frog tadpoles. Eastern spotted newts have a very fascinating lifestyle. They actually are born with gills in the water, then live for several years, sometimes three to seven years on land as a aft after the first season, which is this dry skinned, very colorful, toxic little beast. And then after several years of that, they go back to the water where they become air breathing, but completely aquatic animals, uh, feeding on anything that they're all predatory, of course. So this one might have been feeding early on on the very newborn uh, wood frogs, but now these are too big for them to really be any kind of a threat to them. But again, these are fascinating little salamanders, newts, with a two part life cycle, which is unique to newts. And um, these guys visit vernal pools sometimes regularly in order to get extra food. And they're toxic. They're 10 times more toxic than their F stage, their land stage, where they're dry skinned and can walk away from the water than in their aquatic stage. But they're always toxic. And um, you can see now we have a couple of them here living in this pool. The water's nice and clean and the woods are healthy to allow them to go through these many, many, many years of life before having them come back and complete their adult life in the water, mate, and produce more eggs. They can live several more years. So these guys are at least four years old, probably much, much long, more than that. Eastern spotted newts, one of our more fascinating salamanders.